<laughs> Hello everyone, welcome to another video and welcome to the beautiful Road America where we're going to be doing a Porsche 911 Cup race on iRacing. Now you may or may not have seen that recently I took part in round one of the PESC All-Star Series and got my backside well and truly kicked. My pace was off. I was terrible. And I realized then that I needed to drive the Porsche Cup car more if I'm going to do well in that series. And I thought, what better way to practice than jumping in to a top split race? Now, this is the fixed series. So everybody is using exactly the same setup. So there's no excuses, which I like. So qualifying went better than I expected. We qualified P7 with a 209.196, although we did go all Tokyo Drift on our second qualifying lap and probably lost about three tenths. So we should have probably been good enough for P5. But it is what it is. We're starting P7. We just need to be consistent, look after the tyres, see where we end up. So 12 laps at Road America in the Porsche Cup car, starting P7. Let's get on track. Right, this is going to be... Super tough. Starting P7, so at least we're on the inside. The track so it's going to be difficult. The air temp is 28 Celsius. 12 laps. Right oh, he's going to jump us out to my left. He's got a penalty number 10. Definitely. Come on, lad, you've got a penalty. Just take it like a man. Deal with it. He's going to make life difficult for everybody around him, though, isn't he? Christian Walter. Right, watch for him here. Good save, ho 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 ho! Really good save by Kevin there, blimey. Thought he was dead. I'm sure he thought he was dead as well. Let's see if the guy behind goes in the pit to this lap. If I was him, I'd stay out and try and put me under pressure. See if I make a mistake. There he is. That's exactly what I would have done. I'm sure he did get a penalty. He seemed to jump forward a little bit. We'll see. He'll have three laps to serve it, so we'll see what he does.
doing well to keep that a tight line there. Blimey. No. It's quick, Christian, though. I'm sure this guy's got a penalty though. Know. If he doesn't, I'll be so surprised. I didn't defend it into turn one thinking, I'll let him in front, he's got a penalty, we'll get the position back. I'll kick myself if uh, if he hasn't got a penalty. Oh, blimey. If he hasn't got a penalty. I need to sort this out though. We're all over the place here. Keeping that so tight around there. This is his lap to go in, if he has got a penalty. Must not have, must not have. Unless the next one maybe, that's his last chance to go in. Can't go as quick as him. Two or nine one. No way. breaking myself there every time. would be nice. Now this is his last chance to go in. Yeah. 
no penalty. Well, look at that after the race. I'm sure he moved. Unless it was some kind of weird connection issue. Looked to me like he just nudged forward a tiny bit. Within striking distance now though, Kevin I think. I don't feel like I'm using all the track. Better there. I haven't put the delta on because you can see it on the dashboard there. Two nine four. Bit of sliding. So Lachlan, the guy in P8, he obviously watches me stuff. He said hello before the race, and then he said I'm rapid for an old guy. So I thank you for the compliment. You didn't have to add the old guy in though. You didn't have to chuck that in there. I did have to chuck the old guy in. But thanks, Lachlan. Christian's made a couple of mistakes on this lap. Draft. Well, this isn't a particularly quick lap either. Draft will help us out a little bit though.
<laughs> Sorry, Kevin, and thanks for not running into me there. I appreciate it. That was near death. Even get an instant point there somehow. Gonna try and catch this guy up again now. Oh, we've got it down to a second. They gave me a good look at his good save earlier on, so I've just I've just repaired him. Now I am going to defend this. But you can go around the outside, turn one. Here at Lord America. Pressure. Trying to catch the guy in front also. Loads of pressure from Kevin as well. Struggling with tyres, Christian. Right, back in draft. A little bit of draft, not much. Yes, I know he's Jim.
Right, serious draft now. Try and turn the screw a bit. Those guys fight it out now. Get off there. Got my draft now, though. Two more laps. Kevin's a little bit behind Christians, he's dropped off him a little bit. Melchior's dropped back off Kevin as well. Oh, oh, blimey. Locked up the wheels there. Go back a click on the brake by his knee. There's a send coming there. There's the send. The gap is increased 10.0. Oh, they're all scrapping behind. Blimey. Oh, somebody's off. Kevin has come off worse there. I see these now, one more lap. We're gonna have to go some to take that second and a half out of here. Last lap, here we go. Roman and Koki are close by. Or close to each other, should I say? So I don't need to take any risks on this lap now. Nice and steady. Oh, 
Good racing though with Christian. Tai said no then, Front Tai said no, nah, we're not turning right. Two more turns. could have sworn Christian got a jump start though. But P4, car number six, we'll take that. Great race as well. How far behind the leader? 14 seconds behind the leader in 12 laps though. That's crazy. So fast, those guys at the front. Great little race that one though, thank you Christian. Let's check out the carnage though. Right, so let's have a look at the carnage. If you watch the number 10 car, it does seem to move, but obviously not enough to trigger some kind of penalty. That was where I got that from. Why am I in the highlights? A little bit of door banging there, but all good. Lap one, turn one, expected. Uh-oh, 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 uh-oh. Uh-oh, God. He was trying to get out the way there, I think, as well. Oh, blimey. Good night, my friend. Oh, oh that was close. Oh, this is the guy that was in front of us. Good save though. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, that's alright. He got away with that. Oh, dear me. Oh! Oh, <laughs> his car's toast. No time for blinkers. That's him again, so he's gone. What a nice looking car that is though. I do love the Porsche Cup car. He's gonna blink, so he's gone. Oh, he's go oh. oh. Nice paint. I do like that paint. I did like that paint. I don't like that paint now. Styled it out there, Mr. Vidal. He's gonna blink. Oh, this is what happened behind us. Oh, he just understeered. There was no contact, he just... He did that himself, unfortunately. It's never good going too wide through the kink. Ooh. Ooh. Is that after the race or is the race still going on? Have a look at this again. That looked a bit naughty, that, to be honest.
Let's check that out one more time, actually. Check it out from his onboard. Is he going for the move, do you think? Nah. He wasn't going for the move. See if I can find anything that happened between these two before that. So this is a little bit later on after that punt. So the guy that we're following here punted the number 12. And he gets a bit of karma here, I think. So he tries to go around the outside. This is the last lap. But number 12 saying, no, I'm not having any of that. And then he runs himself off track. I bet the other guy was pissing his pants. See what happened before that, though. So this is the only thing I've found. This was on lap six. So this guy goes for a legitimate overtake on the exit of this turn. I don't think it's his fault at all. But the number 16 car chased him down for the next six laps to run into the back of him. But that's it. So let's jump straight into the results. So there were two splits for this race. This was the top split. The strength of field was 2,962. So we gained 0.19 safety rating. We needed that. And we gained 42 I rating. So Mads got the win. Roman P2 and Koki P3. We finished P number four. Car number six started P7. Our fastest lap was a 209.28. Look at that though from the race winner. 208.42. We had one incident point. Happy days. So who is the biggest I rating winner? Well, it's Christian Walter, the guy we were battling with. He finished P5. He gained 51. And the biggest I-rating loser is going to be Samuel, who finished dead last after one lap. He lost 98. So there we go, P4. Hopefully you enjoyed that one. I had an absolute blast. We gained safety rating. We gained I-rating. And we had a good, fun race. Perfect. I think my pace improved as the race progressed, slowly starting to get used to what you need to do in the cup car to drive a little bit quicker. But it's really tough when you're jumping from the likes of the GT3 cars on ACC, the Skip Barber, and the Porsche cup car just wants to kill you. But the only way is up, and we'll get better, and we'll do better next time in round two of PESC. So shout out to Christian and Kevin in that race. They kept it nice and clean. Really good, fun racing. We nearly died once. I don't know how we didn't die, but we nearly died once and we kept it going and we just got that one incident point. So if you did like this video, please remember, give it a thumbs up. And if you want to see more, please consider subscribing. As always, thanks for watching. Have a great week. See you later. Cheers.